I've been obsessed with Wonder Woman since I was a kid. And when I came across Andrew Cooper and her own obsession with Hollywood culture, I immediately connected to her. She's an artist definitely worth checking out. Wonder Woman. Newfoundland is not Hollywood. It's nothing like Hollywood. My work explores my obsession with Hollywood culture and coming to terms with those images. We have a new generation of, of artists in Newfoundland and our reality was quite different because we're still getting remnants of an old culture, of Newfoundland culture, but uh, we have a huge other culture uh, that is coming to us through the TV. Home is not Hollywood and I'm not a movie star. And I think when I put myself within the context of St. John's as 70 feet, it highlights the unrealities of my own obsessions. I'm working on starring part two, which is four digitally animated sequences of myself as a 70 foot character, but four different characters. The first is actually based on old, old glamour, old Hollywood culture. The second character, basically a Texas kind of character, um, she lives within a wall. She comes out of a billboard. She likes to stuff men in her cleavage. And there's another character, she's got that hungover look and she's choking on objects. So it's almost like she's throwing up. Um, and the fourth character, she's wearing a beige slip and her hair is put back and she's the character that perhaps most resembles myself and she's the vulnerable character. The work is also about stereotypical representations of women. The glamorous woman, the, tr the trampy woman, the, the hungover woman. So they're they're women that are familiar because it seems as though you've seen them before. One of the reasons why I have chosen the internet as a medium uh, to create art is because uh, net art is about identity and geography and lack of and uh, breaking down boundaries. Through digital photography and digital video, collage, I use my own image uh, to create fictional portraits of myself. But my biggest challenge was, okay, who, who cares if it's on the internet? Everybody's got work on the internet. Um, how do you get people to look at the site? So I, I bought airtime on a television station, a local one, and had it aired during the, the news. I had people calling, uh, emailing me saying that it was the biggest waste of time they'd ever spent or was I the most egotistical woman uh, on the planet and I was nothing great to look at anyway. My art practice is not about sitting pretty. It's, it's not about that. I have lots of insecurities and uh, I have to grapple with them in, in, in the face of unrealistic expectations of women in society. But I'm dealing with them and I'm coming to terms with them. In my next series, I think I need to go to Hollywood. I think I need to, to end this series. I, I, I need to confront, I think I need to confront American culture by experiencing it other than through the television and magazines. Yeah.